Welcome to Tsuji. Thank you. This is the first time we are using the English simultaneously to celebrate the Buddha's Day, Mother's Day, and Tsuji Day. For the triple celebration of Mother's Day, Tsuji Day, and Buddha Day this past weekend, the Tsuji USA headquarters in San Dimas, California, invited local interfaith representatives and community partners to join in the Buddha bathing ceremony, which for the first time was presented entirely in English. This was my first Buddha bathing ceremony. I feel very honored that Suchi was willing to share this very sacred ritual with all of us in a language that we can understand. It's a very beautiful place. This is the first time I'm here. I'm always learning from other people, their religion, their culture, and this will be a great opportunity for me to learn this special ceremony. May we break the bad habits. During the ceremony, conducted simultaneously with headquarters in Taiwan via live stream, the faith leaders were moved to a deep sense of togetherness. The people who are coming here today, they come from different faiths and they can see how we respect each other and how can we live together in harmony and peace. One thing that I'm learning that I belong to a larger community, not only the Christian community, but I, lo I belong to like the wild religion. Because our world is so divisive, any and every endeavor we can do together to diminish that divisiveness is worthwhile attending and participating in and that's why I'm here today. As the event continued, many of Su Chi's local community partners came forward to express their gratitude. My heart is overcome with joy and gratitude. This organization is amazing. The American Red Cross is so grateful to have such a wonderful partner, Su Chi. We have very similar mission to provide humanitarian relief and aid to those in need. We're very grateful to you. Uh, you've been a tremendous help in supporting us over the years. So it's been our great honor to partner with the Su Chi Foundation, and we look forward to that continuing partnership. The ceremony concluded with an interfaith prayer, where the day's theme of multicultural love and connection continued. I believe that we all have light within us, whether that light is Christ, or the teachings of the Dharma, or Muhammad. Let us work together. Let us radiate our loving kindness to all living beings. Weave us together in unity and love. When we bring interfaith leaders together, the one common cause is love, great love. Showing the gratitude we have to the Buddha and to all the Almighty God.